Hi, I'm Johanna McCaskill and I'm a family medicine doctor. I've always wanted to find a good way to serve people um, and thought I might want to work overseas one day and I was good at science so I kind of wanted to combine all those things and looked into medicine. In high school I started exploring different options and shadowing doctors and it just felt like a really good fit for me and I've had that confirmation along the way so I think I picked the right job or career path for me. You just never know who's going to walk into your clinic. It could be a kid or a newborn, um, a newborn that I just delivered, still taking care of the mom, taking care of grandparents and then their children. So I just love the like the um, seeing the whole family, but also you have options to work in a hospital or urgent care, emergency, um, so many different ways you can use your training. Um, and I like that. I think one of my greatest strengths as a doctor is um, that I really enjoy listening to people and getting to know the whole story about what's going on besides just what their symptoms are. Um, I like counseling people about different emotional things that are going on, um, coming up with plans of how we can work together to achieve goals to have better health. Um, with more than just taking a pill because there's so many different ways you can take care of yourself and uh, I really enjoy the patient education part of medicine. I want to help people understand what's going on with their body. One of my favorite things to do outside the office is spend time with my husband. We got married last October uh, and it's just been a delight to get to know him and uh, learned a lot about myself through marriage. We like to go hiking together, uh, we like to play music together, we're both um, good at various instruments and he taught me how to play the accordion and we like to write songs together so that's really fun and uh, I really enjoyed um, practicing medicine internationally. In residency I went to Iraq to help with Syrian refugees and just different people that don't have access to medical care um, for a week. And then I've been to Papua New Guinea and Zambia and uh, just learned a lot about how to take care of people when you don't have a lot to work with. So I'm fluent in Spanish. I uh, grew up in Mexico and then as I lived in Tulsa, I was really involved in the immigrant community from various um, Latin American countries. and so. Uh, I really enjoy taking care of my Spanish-speaking patients because you can just connect on a whole different level. Um, of course, I like all my patients, but it's just fun to connect um, whenever you can cross that language barrier.